What it do, what it do, what it do, my beautiful nieces, the beautiful butterflies, divine feminine. Welcome back to the Karmic Circus. It's your girl, Scorpion Queen, but you can call me auntie. Yeah, I'm that auntie that's going to tell you the truth because the truth tells me. And I got to tell you the truth, divine feminine. Um, Some of you may not want to hear this truth. Uh, I'm going to just, okay, I'm going to put it to you this way. It's a masculine energy out here. And something he suggested to you, Divine Feminine, um, when it comes to your sexual relationship, I believe he suggested that you two go to a sex shop or maybe... You suggested it. Take it where it resonates. It's like the overall energy is don't want to hear it. You don't want to hear it. But he's 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 bugging you, trying to tell you that it's it's nothing that he hate about you. It I feel like it was something that this person was trying to spice up. Your sex life. That's what I'm getting. Okay. And you kicked them to the curb if they suggested you go into the sex shop. But this came in reverse. So this could mean um, maybe you're thinking about kicking them to the curb. Maybe you haven't um, kicked them to the curb. Um, This in, in tantric sex is out here. Okay. So that's like meaningful sex. That's that's you and him being on a spiritual level, sexually. Um, emotional sex. You're you're intertwining, you're you're, you know, um together, intimacy, all that, good passionate sex. Okay, spiritual sex. It's like you having sex with your divine partner, your soulmate. You know how to please them. They know how to please you. Okay. And they may have suggested to you to go to a sex shop. Okay. And for somebody, he he may have even suggested that you put on some lipstick and, and you do some little naughty stuff for him. And um, you felt like he... he make like you know like you're insecure but you're not insecure and he don't hate nothing about you he just wanted to spice up your sex life and he don't feel that he made a bad choice by asking you this and this is what i'm getting from this reading from these one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven cards out here with the 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 overall is ten cards with the overall energy be is being, um, I don't want to hear it. So I went looking in my, in my, um, music playlist and this one, it, it, when I turned it on, it popped up with this song. So I had to go back and, and, um, I have it. It came in my instrumental list. Now I know the words to the song, but I'd rather you hear them because right about now, this person is missing you. If you kick them to the curb because they wanted to go in a sex shop and, and get some things to spice up the the sex, um, you could be you could feel like they, they said that you're like you old news and, and you're up to date or maybe they tell it trying to tell you to let's get some new things, let's get into some new stuff. You know, he could have suggested this and you could have kicked them to the curb. So I'm going to play this song, and then I'm going to pull five more cards, a few more cards, to, to see what else I get. Okay? So listen to what, what he's saying, and listen to what she's saying. And you guys didn't heard me play this song many times, so it may strike a nerve with you. Okay? Yeah. I got a soul on soul. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I stay so deep. 
city for me, couldn't know the heat. If the cool just went his head, cause that's that blood shit. I say the least because my body got the sun to take. All the time I cut, but it went down in the sun. I have a dozen hundred friends cooped in my driveway. Tried to have it my way, the fly away, let you with the head. I should have kept it real when I was with you, but instead I missed you. So now I miss you, true. 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 Whoever this person is, you, Divine Feminine, you're in the Nine of Pentacles energy. That means you're financially capable of taking care of yourself. You're financially independent. You can buy what you want. You can do what you want. You can spend what you want. But apparently this is a, a person who... You know, at one time, they was holding a sexual energy from you. Um, or maybe you was holding your sexual energy from them. They could have been putting you in competition with somebody else. There could have been a lot of arguments. Yeah. Yeah, so they they could have put you in a lot of competition or made you believe that, that you was competing for somebody. Uh, they could have said, you know, the way you think is outdated and uh, maybe we should go to a sex shop. Um, I feel like some of you feminines, you said you felt like your person was learning shit and doing shit with other people. And then they come to you with new suggestions new suggestions you know and it's like where'd you where you where you get that from you know why you ask me that like you feel like they're picking up somebody else's energy or they've been doing certain things with other people and now they want to try it on you maybe they was practicing on other people you know hey that's what i'm i'm feeling you know i just gotta they they maybe i don't know I just, I, I supposed to tell you what I hear and I hear somebody's masculine. He's out here because you a divine feminine and I don't mean this, you know, I don't know how you going to take it, but it's what I'm hearing. Some of you divine feminines, <laughs> me including myself, you put it on that masculine, right? You didn't just lay there and let him fuck you. You, 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 you. <laughs> You back that thing up. You wasn't running. Okay. Okay. You wasn't running. And it's like, if anything, he's like, damn, she fucking me back. You know, so this means this masculine is used to women that they just let him fuck them. Lick they pussy. But no, you, you, you work with them. Okay. Divine feminine. You know what I mean? You ain't just laying there and letting them give it to you. You giving it back to them. And they go and they they pick up prostitutes. They watching porn. They they dealing with side pieces and shit and, and side pieces and doing new shit to them. They trying to do new shit just so they can learn. And I know, I know Divine Feminine, you like, we don't want it back, right? 
but they doing all of that. So if they do get a chance, because believe me, I done been there where my person went off and I knew he came back. I knew he went and did something with somebody else because he fucked me different. It was different. I was like, oh, you've been doing something to somebody else. You done learned some new shit. Okay? You know, so you can, your instincts tell you, your intuition tells you. So I'm not saying that that you're, um, that any of you are going to take this person back, but it could just mean that they could be planning for you to take them back and they trying some new shit on all of these, these other people. Okay, I'm not, um, that's what I'm getting, you know, for somebody. And shit, you could have told them, you know, like I said, if you put it down on them, you could have made them feel like they was outdated. So they, they had to go and get with some young chick or somebody young to teach them some shit. Or they could have been watching porn and shit. And now they want to come back. Okay, that's for somebody. But you didn't kick this person to the curb. But he's, you know, if he did suggest this to you, he is, is nothing about you that he hates, Divine Feminine. Nothing. He don't hate nothing about you. Okay? Nothing. He wants tantric sex with you. So, you know, and I'm, again, I'm not saying this. Some of you may want your masculine back and some of you don't. For those of you that do want your masculine back, um, I feel that he was, he went and, and was messing with these other people because... They couldn't compare with you. They couldn't compete with you. And that's right here. He put you in a competition. Some of you are unaware. But you're, even though you're, you're, you know, who you are and how you do what you do, this player couldn't find another you. Period, point blank. I don't care if she was prettier, if she was skinnier, if she was fatter, taller, shorter, Mix, long hair, short hair, whatever. She couldn't do it like you. There was no, there was no mean, meaning. There was no tantric sex. It was just sex. And it's different with you. And this is why this masculine, even if you and him have broken up, there's nothing he, he hate about you. And he 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 don't feel that he made a bad cho a bad choice by, you know, I guess offering this to you. And he knows you're not insecure. He knows that. He was the one insecure. So now he done went off and practice and he wanna come back and show you what he got. <laughs> That's what I'm getting. That's what I'm getting. Yeah. So I'm gonna clear this deck. Let's see what else is going on. He want to come back and um, he want to show you what he's working with. He done learned some new shit, Divine Feminine. Okay, he done learned something new and he want to come try it on you. Some new sexual shit. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Do I got any X-rated decks? Okay, now this deck right here, I can't show the pictures on it. Oh, yes, I can. I forgot. We got little things that I can, I'll get limited on it. So I'm asking everybody to hit that thumbs up button. I'm going to lose monetization on this just for playing that song. Okay, playing Monifa going to get paid for my video. Her and Heavy D, rest in peace. But, you know. So, okay, Holy Spirit. So we know that. This energy is wanting to come back to the divine feminine to show his, to strut his new stuff. So, show me the energy. I have to get my magnifying glass to read these cards because they so small. But I'm looking at the images because this, this is an X-rated deck.
Show me what is this person wanting to... What does this person want? Ooh. For some of you, this person may want a threesome. magnifying glass yeah they coming fast the chariot Sharing energy. Ooh, he may even divine feminine. This person, he coming back. If 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 he don't, if he didn't know how to give you an orgasm. He's finna bring a toy. He's finna bring a, a dildo. He, and he's he when when he do get it, he gonna come quick with that ter chariot, and he gonna take quick action, and he gonna come quick. Can't even see this card. Nine of Swords. Nine of Wands. Nine of Swords. Nine of Wands. The lovers. Knight of Cups. Ace of Cups. Mmm. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Okay. So, okay. For somebody, this masculine, we know, um, for some of y'all, your masculine is going to present, want, want you to be in a threesome with. Okay. For some of you, your masculine is going to bring uh, uh, a, a toy, a, 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 <laughs> a dildo, okay, and he's gonna want to put it in your butt, or he's gonna want to do it with you bent over and him putting it in you from the back, in your pussy, we all adults here now, all right? If this masculine wasn't passionate with you, if he wasn't kissing you, um, he's gonna he's gonna be doing that. I don't know if he's if he's stolen this energy. He stole some energy from somebody else. 
Now, he could have stolen this energy from you, Divine Feminine, and took it to somebody else, or he could be stealing somebody else's energy and bringing it to you. If he come back and he's a different person sexually, that's somebody else's energy. You see, he's been into threesomes and shit. Okay. Remember he said he gonna he's gonna bring a, a, a dildo or something. Okay. That's a dildo and he got her bent over. Okay. Some of you, your masculine may, he's gonna come trying to do something different sexually. He wants to outperform you or something to that effect. You know, because you apparently you overpower him, you tame him, so he wants to come back in that energy. Okay, so whoever this masculine is, he's he's not he's not um it, it I don't think it's gonna be no oral sex. I think he wants he wants he wants to like uh put put a lot of emotions like it, it's like he he wants to show you he wants to show you how he feels about you rather it's that he cares about you that he has feelings for you that he loves you it's something he he wants to prove to you using sex he this may be a masculine that may, you know, let's see. Why did this masculine want to prove to Divine Feminine? Seven of Swords out here. He's he's trying to be sneaky. What is the Seven of Swords? He's trying to oh he oh he wants to start over with you. So he wants to come to you with the with the, this full energy. Yeah, he has an open and curious mind and a sense of excitement to be with you intimately because he didn't learn some shit. You guys may have been broken up for a while, you know, and he didn't he didn't learn some some new shit from somebody else. And he coming to try it on you. That's what I'm getting. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Well, for some of you, this masculine, he he lost his money because. He was going with prostitutes. And this is how he, he's learning this shit. Yeah, because he, he's, he's, yeah, he's having threesomes. He's laying with low vibrational women. Okay? Yeah, he is. Mm-hmm. Tell me more. Why does this masculine, why, why does he want to please the divine feminine? What is his? The world. It would be a joyous accomplishment for him to reunite with you or for him to unite with you. For some of you, this may be somebody who you've never been with. And maybe they're out doing something with other people. So just so they can come towards you. I'm not... Trying to, you know, I'm, I'm just saying what I'm seeing because I hear y'all in the comments already. I'm, I'm just saying, y'all, this is what I'm getting. This is what the cards are saying. Don't be mad at auntie. <laughs> I can hear my nieces out there like, uh, uh that motherfucker better go on and whoop the whoop and uh, uh, I ain't dealing with him. But it's some of you out there who, who will accept your person back. Okay. And, you know, for some of you, this is somebody who you probably ain't never met. It could be an energy coming towards you. And in the process of meeting a true divine feminine, they out there hoeing around until they meet you. Some of them then, then met you and they trying to, trying to find that same energy in somebody else and they can't find it. They ain't going to find nobody in no divine energy 
that's going to love them unless they run into another divine feminine, which is possible, okay? But you, divine feminine, this person, he want to he wanna pull your little string panties down. Somebody is wearing G-strings. And, um, be careful. I see, I see, I see also the energy. Oh, okay. For some of you divine feminists, be careful. This, that motherfucker that I'm getting out here. I gotta light me a cigarette. That was a butt that I smoked. Where I put it? Um, this, this, this man could be trying to record you. I see a camera. Okay. And I see the swords. You may, you may know this. Yeah. He may try to record you or something. So be careful. For some of you, if this is somebody new coming towards you, they may, you know, uh, be trying to put you on some sort of porn. Okay, somebody could be putting you on, on porn. And y'all may be thinking I'm chain smoking, but I put a lot of cigarettes in my ashtray and they end up smoking themselves because the ash just be long. So end up, then I end up lighting another one. Like, damn, she smoked all the cigarettes. No, that's how they go so fast. Is this this damn seven of swords? Oh, no, this is somebody you stood up to defending yourself. So this could be somebody you could have defended yourself when it comes to, to sex with them. Um, you could have told them they got to wear protection or something. You're protecting yourself sexually from this person. They still going to try to, they still, they, I don't see no oral sex here. No oral sex. They, they may even not try to penetrate you. They may just want to want to try some toys on you oh no let me let me get back in this deck what else spirit when it comes to the sexual energy between this masculine and the divine feminine Some some people is kinky and like that. This masculine, he like to put his fingers all in your mouth and shit. Yeah. I gotta say it. Divine feminine. Somebody got a nasty masculine. He either gonna. <coughs> Put his fingers in your pussy and then try to put them in your mouth. <laughs> I don't know who energy is. This is a freaky ass mask. He wants you to taste your own pussy. He telling you, look, look how good it tastes. Here, taste it, taste it, taste it. Taste your pussy. <laughs> Damn, okay. <laughs> See? Ooh. Okay, I gotta say this. Some of you, the reason this masculine is why the oral sex is out is not out here is because somebody's twat. He he don't he don't want to taste it because the smell. And he's 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 trying to let you know in a subtle way by putting your fingers down there, putting your fingers down there, and making you and letting you smell and taste it. Like so, if you're saying no, mm -mm, well, what do you think he's saying? 
Somebody, somebody better wash their twat. He could have stood up to you. Or if this is not you, this could be a karmic feminine. That he's, he's, he could be using a, um, a toy on her. He may not even be fucking her. He may just be, he may get a, 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 a arousal out of him taking a dildo and using it on her and making her finger herself. That's what I'm getting. Apparently she likes it. I don't know. Is this you, Divine Feminine? <laughs> yeah, this it ain't no kissing either. It's it's hot, passionate sex. It's like somebody wants to play like they're Prince Charming, like they're coming in. Somebody is used to, to pay him for pussy. Oh, so okay. So he's he's been practicing on, on, on different holes, and this is some of their energy. He stuck his fingers in one of these holes, pussy, and told her to basically taste her pussy. And it don't smell right. It don't taste good. Damn. That's what I'm getting. These are this is some feminine energies. See, he's he's been practicing with them. I know you don't want him back. I know you don't, but this is this is what he's planning. Yeah. Mm. Oh. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. Somebody said because I said Holy Spirit, I blocked them. Like I'm wrong for calling on the Holy Spirit, even though these toxic karmic low vibrations. They, the, the Holy Spirit is the one telling me about this shit, dumbass. I ain't in church just because you ain't sitting up in church 24 hours a day. That don't mean the Holy Spirit don't talk to you. Somebody is wearing a dress. I'm sorry, but this woman, let me see, her ass look all to her. I got to see to describe what I'm seeing. Her ass is toe up. Look at that hole in her ass. Look at that. So she like getting it in the back door. Yeah. He may try to come with you, Divine Feminine. He may try to go to you. See, these hoes is letting them go all in their duke shooting shit. We don't play that. We don't like it. Mm -mm. Damn. Okay, so her ass is her ass is out. I mean her that that her ass is 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 that look like a shotgun wound in her ass. Damn. That's one of these hoes, letting them fist them and doing all of that shit, putting their whole arm up their ass and shit. Some people is into bestiality, they fucking horses and shit. Yeah, that's what her asshole look like, a horse done been up in that motherfucker. This whoever he's fucking with is a hoe that, that her hole is shit. A whole nother man could probably hide up in that motherfucker. Damn, a midget probably jumped up out of that motherfucker. Like, hey, wait your turn. I'm still in here. <laughs> Damn. Wow. Damn. Her asshole is so beat up that you could hide an actual midget up in that motherfucker. This is a hole. Damn. Mm. 
He just he just likes the way her body look. He's not whoever masculinist is. Um, I don't know if this is with all the hoes that he just get a, a thrill out of shoving shit up in him, some ditty shit, or and he's taking pictures. The ass is, is got a big hole in it. She could be some sort of demonic animal or something. I don't know. Ooh, Lord. This is this is some witchy shit. So I'm about to get up out of here. This is getting a little bit too um, provocative, if that's the word for me. Explicit. So I'll see you guys in the next week. Peace out.